KFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Tuesday, Tuesday, the uh, 5th of March. We're looking at the Dow down 169. What a bifurcated market this is. At 38,818, just testing the up mini up channel. <clears throat> Chapman wave inside track. Propellant line, will it break down? We'll see. S&P is also down. Uh, there was just some news breaking a few moments ago, and there was a spike in the market. But the S&P is down 22 at 5109. Uh, this is going to be very important. Uh, what happens next? Because we've still got the nine period moving average over the 14 in all the indices. They haven't turned negative yet. That is still strong um, action technically. We're looking at the QQQ. It was pulling back earlier on, still down five at 439.06. I made a high three days ago, 446.98. Holding the nine period moving average, IWM, where is that? Right now it's down 31 cents at 205.42. Struggling a little bit, made a new recovery high yesterday, pulling back now. The big story here is talk about big. Gold is up another $21. Something's going on. Uh, at 2148, we've had in just four sessions from 2040 to 2147. That is a huge move. We've seen these candles before in gold, and then they uh, fail. But in this particular instance, the um, weekly chart is still very strong. The night didn't go negative. So this is something to uh, to monitor because the dollar is only down a fraction, down two ticks. I've been talking about this for a while. We're looking at markets that are not doing the traditional thing. I'll talk about that in my show coming up in a few minutes. And now we've got the bonds <laughs> and bonds have spiraled higher up. They were up a point before. Now they're up um, one point and 20, 30 seconds, almost two points. That is incredible. So this now in the uh, daily 30-year T-bond continuous contract is a leg B stopping right dead, right on the 200-period moving average. What happens next? If yields keep coming down, I think that that could help the market. So we're looking at this saying, what happens next? And that's really important because gold, that big move, is quite something. And crude oil is a down. I'll be right back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. Stay tuned. Psyching Day.